I made a FNAF fan game on scratch in one week, and not only that, I got 30 minutes each day to use sparingly while making the game. So hey guys, it's Volt, and welcome to another video. So today I'm gonna show you the development of the game I made in one week. By the way, for your information, the reason it says sorta is because I couldn't make, for example, a toggle jump scare button and sounds, so I had to make small exceptions to that rule. But without further ado, let's begin. I started the project with making the first domain antagonist Frozer, and then I made a warning screen, not that interesting I know, and after that I started working on the menu screen by copying and adding the Frozer model and giving him a twitching effect. Shortly afterward I made a title screen, and my dumbass wasted a lot of minutes on detailing it instead of just adding regular text. After that I added a new game button, made a blue background, and ended the day with making the newspaper. On the second day the first minutes were completely wasted, I just coded a little. But then I designed the office. Adding multiple amounts of detail and lightning effects to it to make it look appealing, I even added a parallax effect and a door, I began on making the camera system, and since I had little time left, the only thing I made was just a button for activating and deactivating the cameras, an animation for the monitor flipping up and down, the monitor booting up, and with a few minutes to spare made a map of the building. Okay, so on day 3 not a lot of progress was made compared to the other days, but I managed to add two camera rooms, Frozer's stage and the dining area. And I even managed to add a new character, Shill. Here it is. You know what, there is not much to say. This day was honestly wasted. Let's just proceed to the next one. Okay, day 4. Honestly, I'm a little worried if I'm even gonna complete this game, since it's day 4 and I've barely made any progress. Not much didn't happen on this day either, just added 4 extra rooms and coded a lot on the rooms. Let's hope that tomorrow is gonna be a better day. Now we're talking! This day was filled with growth. I made the last camera rooms and it did take a while. But I also managed to add the buttons used to change the camera, coded them, and I even managed to add a toggle button which would change between the vent cameras and the room cameras. At least a bit more progress than the previous days, but let's see how day 6 will go. We're coming close to our limit. I started the day by coding a little on the toggle button, nothing interesting. And also, even though the game was originally gonna have 5 nights, I realized that it would be too annoying to add, so I changed it to just 1 night. And on day 6, I came a little prepared. Since cameras in FNAF games always have static, I backpacked a static sprite I found on Scratch before recording. <laughs> Let's go. After that I made the third and last character, and oh my god, he's the ugliest character I've ever made. This was supposed to look like a gingerbread cookie, and it doesn't even look remotely to that. If that thing wasn't named Ginger, people would have never known that this is a gingerbread cookie. However, I added Ginger to the cameras, wasn't that difficult to model, and after doing that, I changed the colors of the map for when the player is toggling the vent cameras and the room cameras. And now it's time for the defenses. I began with making the defense against Frozer, which is basically a heater that you need to aim at him in order to make him go away. I made the heat vent button, and ended the day with making a little bit of progress on the AI. Now, we've made a lot of progress on just day 6, but let's wait for day 7, the final day. Will I achieve my goal? Now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time. We've arrived to the final day. Now it's time to rush. I made the AI for the characters. I added the clock and winning screen, the shock button for getting rid of Ginger, and ended the video with getting on time. Or, sort of. Like I said in the beginning, I didn't have enough time to make the jump scares button, which is essential for the game not getting taken down. Yes, Scratch Team, I'm looking at you and your bullshit guidelines. Uh, so I had to make an exception to that rule, and I also needed to add some audio, so... Yeah. Okay, so this is my new game, Frostbite, a FNAF fan game made in just one week with only half an hour to spare. Now this game is a little broken, uh, 
but I can't really edit the game anymore, as long as the bugs aren't like incredibly game-breaking. Um, but uh, otherwise, these glitches aren't that major, so that's right. And if you actually want to play this piece of shit, then uh, yeah, the description is down below. But guys, that was actually the end of the video. So if you want more content like this, be sure to leave a like or a comment and feel free to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you want me to do another challenge on making scratch games, be sure to hit me up in the comments. You can also join my Discord server. In here we talk and chill and have fun. So yeah, the link is down below if you want to join. But yeah, have a nice day and I'll see you on the next video. Adios.